Now we are behind the scenes inside of my Facebook fan page for my marketing agency, Next Generation Digital Marketing. What I want to show you first is that we're in the kind of our personal feed, right? So we see that, not personal, but fan page feed. So we see posts from other businesses, businesses that are running ads, businesses that we feel like Facebook would think that we would be interested in. So what you want to do is actually go inside to the left. And this is the navigational bar, right? You can see that, again, as I said, we are in my marketing agency's fan page. We have access to the ads manager, the ad center, and Meta Business Suite. So in this section, we're going to talk about how you can use Meta Business Suite to manage both your Facebook page and your Instagram account a little bit easier. So what you see now that the page has loaded is my Facebook page and my professional Instagram account together because I connected the two inside of here. So we can now easily manage both the Facebook page and the Instagram account, even when we go to create posts, create ads, or even a reel or story. This is the hub for the Meta Business Suite. So you will see where we have messages and comments that we can respond to here. We can even create tasks for ourselves in here. So you see, I don't really use this very often, but if you are someone that wants to keep a list of all of your tasks, this will be a section for you. And then you will see recent posts and you get to have a snapshot of your last five posts, both on Facebook and Instagram, what they're doing with the engagement. And then you'll see recent stories and here is the planner and ads that you're creating inside of your ad center, not your ad manager, just your ad center. And that will be a different animal altogether, but don't worry, I got you covered. We're going to be talking about that in our next section. So let's dive in really quickly and let me show you how to use the planner, okay? So I'm going to go here to the left hand side and actually show you the planner because I love the planner here in Meta Business Week. One of the things that you can see inside of the planner is that they give you moments of different social media days, right, that you can use. So you see December 1st is National Christmas Lights Day. Never heard of it before. December 4th is National Cookie Day. Tuesday, December 13th is the last week of fall. So you can use all of those moments to create content around for your audience. I love that Facebook, or I should say Meta, actually gives you that content so you don't have to look for it somewhere else. It's built into the planner. Now, if you go to the upper right-hand corner, you'll see the button that says Create. The drill down menu actually will say, what are you creating today? Are you creating a post, a story, a reel, or an ad? Now, I don't create my ads here. I create them in Ads Manager. But let's pretend like we're going to create a post. We will click Create Post um, really quickly. Once it loads up, you see that you can actually post to Facebook or Instagram or both just by checking it. So if you want to do both Facebook and Instagram, now you can do so. You can add a photo, a video, or you can use a template, which I love. And then write some text. It will show you how, what it's going to come up with right here. So let's just add something for the file manager. It's not showing anything right now for whatever reason, but you kind of get the point, right? So you can publish now or schedule, or you can save it as a draft. And it will show up right here in the Facebook newsfeed preview or the Instagram feed preview to see how it would work with your existing content. You got to love it. 